Hey YouTubers, welcome to the party. So I'm gonna show you guys how to reset your remote just in case you got a new TV, you already got direct TV, but now you have a new TV and it's not programmed. Uh, I'm gonna show you how to program it like us technicians do it. So first thing you're gonna do is find the mute and the select button, hold it down at the same time. One, two, then you're gonna hit, go ahead and press nine, eight, one light's gonna blink on two there you go now it's a brand new remote it's not configured to any system at all so now my remote is like a brand new remote it's not programmed to anything it's not even set into rf mode so right now it's on infrared mode so first thing you want to do is you want to get it to rf mode just so you don't have to point to the box every time you want to change the channel and stuff like that so to set in RF mode, you go to mute and enter. Ready to mute, enter. You press it on the same time. And you just watch the TV. And then you see that screen come up. You are now set up for RF. All right, now let's program our remote. So we're gonna hit the volume. It's gonna ask us to program remote. Um, it used to be programmed to the Toshiba, so now I reset it. It's just going to go through the motions again. So if you had a new TV, you would say change TV, select change TV, and you'd put the brand name. So for this TV, it's still a Toshiba. It's going to pop up. It would just go to the brand name. And for model number, you would just go to, I don't know. And it usually does it in the first one. So follow direction. Just going to ask you to hit the volume. Volume works. Now it's programmed to the TV. So you would select it worked. If it doesn't, you go to try next code. Um, some TVs like the TCL Roku TVs take a couple of um, tries, but it works also with the sharp TVs. So not a TV's program, but I have a surround sound system. If you don't have a surround sound system, you just go down to done. But if you do have a surround sound system, let's go with the same thing. So for this one, it would be on keel. So let's do that. Select the brand right there. Model number, do not know. So now you would just watch your audio device. Once I see the volume changing, okay, it works. So you select, it works. And now you wanna lock it. Make sure you lock it to the audio device, not the TV. So I wanna lock it to the audio device, use audio device. And so now when I hit the volume, it's just gonna turn up the um, audio device and not the TV and make that echo effect and that's it your remote is all set I hope that helped you guys out a lot um, subscribe to my channel I'm gonna be doing a lot more just to help out customers out there save them money and save them the headache of calling in direct TV and stuff like that um, any questions comments let me know Thank you.